So the state of our town is growing stronger every day. Driving around our community, reminiscing about this past year. Checking out some of the great projects that we fulfilled together. For last year, I consider the biggest success for our department would be the start of construction for the stormwater bond projects. And I consider this a big success as we're gonna be providing flood relief for many areas throughout the town. The most significant achievement or accomplishment for the finance department is on behalf of the mayor and council, we executed um, the senior citizen relief program where we issued, monitored, and reconciled in-house 385 checks, rebate checks, that is, to our senior citizens. This year, our biggest accomplishment to date has definitely been the development and moving forward of our Optimus Park redesign. This year, we were able to not only solidify the project scope and budget, but get it approved to move forward for a vote and referendum to the public. So this project looks at taking part of something that's been in the works for 10 plus years uh, as far as redesigning and redeveloping an outdated older park. So this is going to be something that's not only an impactful for now, but for generations to come. And aside from providing our residents and elected officials a balanced budget, we also provided a video explaining our property tax bill to all our residents. This year, your police department continues to provide the best service to its citizens by providing an atmosphere free of crime and the fear of crime. We have one of the lowest crime rates in all of South Florida. We continue to have our officers responding to calls expeditiously and fast. We have some of the best response times, the best response times in all of Miami-Dade County. And our officers continue to provide these mission objectives while practicing the core values of integrity, respect, service, and fairness. It is impossible to choose a favorite project in securing over $20 million thus far for stormwater infrastructure, transportation and mobility options, the freebie program, urban tree canopy, and my favorite, I guess if I had to pick one, it would be the Scottsfield. Uh, this year we have done a lot of things for the town of Miami Lakes, including passing ordinances to improve our, our business and economic development, our micro-mobility options, uh, we've expanded uh, service of freebie. So we are bringing a lot of quality of life to the town of Miami Lakes, including processing all your applications for variances so that you can improve your properties and, um, and bring up the property values of Miami Lakes. And on behalf of the Communications and Community Affairs Department, we are incredibly proud of everything we've accomplished this year. Together with our volunteer boards and committees, we've hosted over 50 events serving more than 30,000 residents. This past fiscal year, we have accomplished many great things. We are most proud of improving our overall cyber and physical resiliency of the town. For example, we were able to train our staff and contractors in uh, basic knowledge and skills on cybersecurity prevention and detection. Also, we were able to have an internet failover for our town hall, among over many other great things that we did this past fiscal year. We've defended the town in multiple litigations. Most notably, we concluded litigation on the Northwest 154th Bridge, which protects the welfare for all Miami Lakes residents. Our biggest accomplishment was achieving 85% compliance rate on all of our open cases in code enforcement. So what that means is that all of our cases were mitigated without having to issue a fine. And there you have it. The state of our town is stronger than ever, and it's growing stronger every single day, thanks to the hard work and dedication of our staff and all those Miami Lakers that have instilled their trust in us. We're gonna continue working harder every single year, and next year, we'll ensure it's even that much more special than this year.